beautiful and gorgeous wooden trim guys i am in love with this it feels like driving an a-class but a luxurious a-class the latest mercedes-benz s-class specific key it's like floating on a cloud it feels so nice it's definitely ahead of all its competitors when talking about the 7 series or the a8 250 and that's it guys Hello guys, I am back welcoming you all with this. Today I will be presenting you the brand new Mercedes-Benz S-Class again. And why? Because we have the opportunity to be driving this today for the first time ever. I am in Immendingen currently at a Mercedes-Benz press drive event where we have the possibility to drive the s-class so stay tuned for that so in today's video i will be doing a quick walk around showing you all the exterior features afterwards we will be jumping inside and taking this s-class out for a drive afterwards we will be checking all the cool features the assistant systems the autonomous drivings here on the test center and last but not least finish it all off with a resume so let me talk about this kind specific here we have for the first time ever the s580 version of the s-class this is the v8 version plus the starter generator supporting the engine producing 503 brake horsepower and 700 newton meter of torque so it's it's very powerful and it's the first v8 option as you know the 500 engine i had shown you in the first video it's uh, inline six cylinder and this is the first v8 can't wait to see the 63 to be honest so let's start with the quick walk around just a quick one and afterwards with the dry so let's go starting here with the walk around first things first we have the front of this beautiful s-class to be honest it's an improvement i love the front of the latest s-class it's very dominant it looks very classy and this is the amg line looking very very sporty let's just focus on the headlights here i am very sorry as you see it's currently raining but still we will be filming this for you and therefore i apologize here you see we have the headlights the latest ones s-class specific we have the main led unit as you see and the three led torches which stand out for the s-class itself these are the optional digital headlights which look super cool and are very very nice using them especially in the night continuing with the front here we have the new s-class grille three horizontal lines here we have the covers as you see we have the front camera here i don't like how that just pops out here destroying the overall look i wish it would just uh, come out automatically this doesn't look good for me just my personal opinion all in all we have the front bumper here looking very very sporty it almost looks like the jet wing design we have with the uh, with the v8 amgs as you see here it's full finished in chrome as we have no night package here and the exterior paint on this is onyx black just for you to know continuing with the side as you see here we have the s-class this is the long wheel based version very nice as you see we have no night package we have all the chrome parts here continuing with the rims here we have the 20 inch multi-spoke amg line rims looking very nice and classy they fit to almost every single car and also on the s-class here as well continuing here with the side you see we have the new door handles if you want to get in you need to be unlocking the car so they pop out if you lock the car again they move back in and now it's time to focus on the rear of this beautiful s-class and here we have it guys uh, first time when i saw the s-class in person i didn't like the rear but now from time to time i started to really get used to it and to like it it doesn't really look as classish because there is no s-class dna as i already mentioned in the first video but it does look nice and i think it will look much better with the 63 and the maybach version of this so let's continue here with the tail light as you see new redesigned tail lights with 116 led pins as you see we also have them moving lights here just look at these very very cool sharp design here and we have the chrome 
parts also the mercedes-benz stars and the rear diffuser it's full finished in exterior paint which i really love and then we have these exhaust tips and the rear ones behind how do you guys like this s-class spec here so now it's time to take this thing out for a drive guys but before we do that let me also show you the key as you see here the latest mercedes-benz s-class specific key i'm not sure if this is just for the s-class or they will also use this for other models let's see now it's time to drive it let's go So we are now starting the drive inside the new S-Class, guys. The atmosphere created by this interior, it's, it's overwhelming, guys. It does feel very luxurious and comfortable, but it's on a whole new level when you look at the full beige and bright interior, plus the beautiful and gorgeous wooden trim, guys. I am in love with this. You saw all the press cars, they had the piano or the carbon fiber look. They were too glossy and this one looks super elegant with the wooden trim. So now we have the handbrake over here and um, yeah, the shift knob out of plastic. I'm not a big fan of putting it into drive. As you see, the light options have moved up over here. Back then they were like lower on the bottom next to your legs and now we are riding out with the new s-class first things first while turning we have the rear axle steering in that s-class and guys it's it feels so wrong and different but it's super cool i mean it, it feels like driving an a it feels like driving an a-class but a luxurious A-Class. I mean, it does feel so short, but it's not. It's basically, this is the long wheel base. And due to the rear axle steering wheel, you don't even feel it. Like mostly if you have a longer car, it's more difficult to, to drive and else. But this one, nah, it's, it's super comfortable. I love this, guys. It, it feels so nice. Improving the driving comfort plus the sound in the interior you don't have anything you don't hear any noises from from the street the tires or else it's it's very very nice as you know i'm a more comfortable driver i like to do autobahn runs and we will be also doing an autobahn run with this but it's like floating on a cloud even though we have a v8 version in that the 580 it's very powerful and if you step on it it's really fast but still it doesn't feel that sporty but if you want it can be sporty like if you change into a uh, sport driving mode it is so now we are making our way to the german autobahn where we will be also pushing and demonstrating you the performance of this brand new s-class the 580 version will be available next year guys stay tuned for that this is also the same engine we have in the gls the gls 580 the v8 with the starter generator as you see we have the argumented reality in the on the display itself plus on the head-up display which is very very cool now this is the entrance of the german autobahn it's friday and it's kind of full but still i hope we can push this car won't push it to the max because it's wet right now we have rain here in germany let me just change to sport plus now unrestricted here 
As you see, it's a little bit crowded now because most of the people left work. You also have a nice sporty sound as soon as you switch to Sport Plus. That's super cool. As I told you, in comfort, you didn't have any engine noises, exhaust noises or else. But now with Sport Plus, it does feel very, very cool. Now let's, let's do this. All hands on the steering wheel, unrestricted here. It's easy to push in. I'm very sorry, I hope you still have a great insight about how sporty this car can drive. It's not made for sporty drivings, as you know. It's basically made for luxury trips, for uh, long distance trips in style, with comfort. And you definitely have this with the new S-Class. Instantly push in. Let me also demonstrate to you the cruise control, the more comfortable driving style with this car. You have the settings right on the steering wheel as you see here. Um, so it's very, very cool to control. I will be setting it to 140 right now. And as we have the lane assist, you don't need to steer it. But as like after 15 seconds, the system acknowledges that your hand is not on the steering wheel then starts to vibrating and giving you signals to put your hands back on the steering wheel. I will be demonstrating you that as well. As you see, everything is green. But now you see that it's a warning telling me to put my hands back on the steering wheel. What I'm doing now and it's instantly recognizing my hands. I'm very sorry I couldn't do a proper autobahn run but since the autobahn is too crowded I don't want to risk other people's life and mine either so I hope you all respect that and I hope you still enjoy the beautiful drive in this nice and comfy S-Class guys so now we have finally arrived at our destination in a car park at the Stuttgart airport. Just look at the beautiful ambient lighting. Now you can see it more clearly. We have a new ambient lighting called Active Ambient Light Active. Really love the atmosphere here. Um, as you can see, this is not the normal ambient lighting. They have also updated this. Wow, MG GT 63S over there. Looking very nice. And uh, wow. Just look at this, enjoying my last ride. I will be having an S-Class. I will be having an S-Class soon in Düsseldorf as well. We will be doing some night drives with this. It's the best car to enjoy and some more. So stay tuned for that as well. Now we will be uh, finishing it off and leaving the car. Just look at this, Schmies SLS, nice. And we'll be finishing of the press drive here. Lovely, enjoying the last seconds. Pure joy. Awesome. 
now leaving the car. Awesome experience. Big thanks to Mercedes-Benz. So that's it basically for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed watching. How do you guys like the S-Class, the S-Class drive, the exterior, the interior and this specific spec? For me, honestly, this car is setting whole new standards. It's definitely ahead of all its competitors when talking about the 7 Series or the A8. Honestly, guys, this is a pioneer of automotive standards and you will definitely see a lot of the things that the S-Class implemented in the next generation of, for example, compact cars and else. So stay tuned for the future, guys. Please do not forget to check out my Instagram, my TikTok. Do subscribe to this channel. Please, let's push it. And looking forward to see you all again. Wish you all a great day. I will be back.